Damn, man. These days, I'm constantly having to wake up at freaking at the break of dawn because there's so much to do because Black Friday is coming up. This is, I think, three weeks straight where I've been waking up at around 4.45 to 5. It's 5.25. My hair is done, brushed my teeth, ready to rock and roll. But I'm really excited because um, this Black Friday at BottleBrigade.com, I think we're having the biggest launch like of new stuff that we've ever had for a Black Friday, as well as some of the craziest deals you've ever seen. And we got some really special stuff. So for example, I really, really like this sweater. It's our Dominate Holiday Sweater. And it's our take on the ugly Christmas sweater. Cause you know, like during Christmas and holidays or New Year's, or whatever, you're supposed to wear the ugly Christmas sweater, right? But I'm like, why does it have to be ugly? Why can't it be dope and gangster, but still have that Christmas spirit? So we spent time designing this one. And I think it's freaking cool. And dominate holidays, you know what that means. That means time to eat all the good food, hang out with all the friends and family, have a good ass time because it's the re it's the end of the year. It's time to celebrate, and we could do the whole dominate humbly thing in the new year. But I'm about to go to the gym right now. I'm meeting up with Justin and Brandon. We're gonna shoot all kinds of content because we got knee sleeves, wrist straps, straps dropping, restocking on a lot of the top heavy hitters, best sellers this year. So uh, make sure you go to barbellbrigade.com. Actually, you uh, go to barbellbrigade.com, like I was saying, but I think it's really important for you guys to sign up for the newsletter. Because if you sign up for the newsletter, we're gonna email you guys early access because you guys watch this channel and you guys are closer to me. And we're gonna give you an additional discount code that's 5% off on top of whatever sale is on the website. That way you don't have to compete with the rest of the public that just looks at stuff from far away. So that way the sizes are still there. Hopefully everything's in stock. So make sure you go to barbellbrigade.com, go to the newsletter and sign up so you can have early access and a additional 5% discount code on top of everything that we're dropping. See you guys at the gym. All right, at the gym now. Those of you guys have been asking, we finally got it here now. We got Bottle Brigade knee sleeves. These things are super thick, super comfy. And then we also got wrist wraps. Bam, son, look at that. And then we got both regular lifting straps. So the traditional kind. And these are soft, but still uh, like military grade material. So it wraps around easy, but it's really, really strong. And we got the Olympic weightlifting style. I've been uh, becoming more of a fan of these guys because it's easy to put on and it just hangs on you. It doesn't really pop out, but to each their own, whatever you guys want. But all, all of you guys have been looking for lifting equipment like, yo, how come Barbell doesn't make any? Bam, all of this drop in uh, Black Friday. Just finished banging out all the content. Turned out really, really good. Um, if you guys are in LA and you don't want to pay for shipping, you can also come to the gym and get most of the stuff. Right now, this is what we have at the front. We got the comfy shorts. We got the dry duffel. We got the all day long sleeve. We still got some stuff from the veterans capsule. Um, we still got a bunch of t-shirts like always. And uh, I know that the gym just got knee sleeves, wrist wraps, all that. So uh, if you guys don't want to pay for shipping and you're in LA, I know there's a lot of LA peeps out there. You can come here and get all the equipment that I just showed you. See you later, Cyrus. <laughs> All right, Cyrus is our in-house cholo. Yeah. Show him the tattoo you just oh, got, yeah, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't, I can't show it just yet, but you got it all going Did on. Did that right hurt now. on the neck? Dude, I was crying. You were crying for reals? No, not yet, but it was eight hours. Eight hours of that. Oh, damn. It's terrible. It goes down to my back. What do you do when you're getting tattooed? Uh, clench my fist. Really? Okay. Listen to music. Try to listen to the most aggressive music as I can. Just For real? Yeah. Damn, I do the opposite. <laughs> you know what I used to do? So when I used to get all my work done, uh -huh. I would go with like stand-up comedy, like just like Dave Chappelle, and then I would just play it like on a laptop. Because then I notice when I'm watching funny movies like Step Brothers or whatever, it doesn't hurt as much. Holy shit. Yeah. Because I'll be doing because uh, all my sessions are like eight-hour sessions. Yeah, yeah. So, so it's gonna. Yeah. So I was. Helping at all. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Find some comedies and bring some comedies on an iPad or laptop. For sure, I gotta do a part. All uh, right, have a good day. Take care. Take care. That's like the over in Pasadena now. Everyone's here at David's gym. We got David, Nick, 
Alex just met Johnny. He works with Theo Vaughn Gilbert. And uh, good thing everyone's doing a slightly light, high volume day. Because as you guys know, I pulled my hamstring. So can't be going hard, but we all know David likes going hard out of nowhere. So hopefully we can keep it nice and chill so that doesn't turn on my ego and competition drive. And we can just get some light training and uh, keep my hamstring nice and recovered because it's doing really good right now. I think I'll be able to lift pretty much 90, 95% of what I was lifting, I think in one more week. This is the sparring of the senseis. Next to coach, obviously, and Jason's the best. Jerry's been kickboxing like 15 years. It's nice to see them move, it's so beautiful. You just see like all kinds of fluid movement, defense, offense, back and forth. And they both could read each other. Ooh, you're gonna challenge them? Ooh, so scary, man. So beauty. Ooh, I thought you guys were going light, what the hell? Jesus. I call this ego sparring. Dave, why are you on the ground, dude? Dave, why don't you go spar someone? I just, I just got my ass whooped. What you talking about? Okay, all right, cool. cool. Me too, me too. Yeah. Yeah, me too. Hey, only spitting stuff. Only spitting, go. I had a crazy good training session. So good to the point where you ever train so hard that you just blank out. So um, we got to uh, our lunch place, our place to get lunch. I can't even say that correctly. But we went to uh, next door, which is Sahara's, which is so bomb, like the best Mediterranean Middle, Middle Eastern food ever. And I wanted to share that place with you guys, but I remember just sitting there and just kind of staring at my food. And I'm like, and I just ate it. And I was just listening to everyone talk, so I didn't even vlog. So uh, that's how brain dead I was, but that's a really, really good workout. Now you might be like, wait, where is this place? I've never seen it before. I'm at David's new spot. So me and David, we got to go to our uh, Lotus meeting, which is the food group for Shrimp Daddy, Sip, Chichi Dango, and also a new one. I don't know if I could tell you guys yet, so I don't, I won't say the the new concepts name. Dude, Hurry up and get, go shower, dude. We're gonna be late. We're gonna be late, dude. <laughs> Motherfucker. Um, I did monetize my own channel. <laughs> And so uh, one thing you guys know about me, I'm all about efficiency. And since I know David lives really close to where we kickbox, I'm like, I'm gonna just bring my clothes. And I texted David, yo, can I shower at your place? That way I can maximize everything. So a lot of the things that I like to do when people they go, damn, how's your schedule like so packed or so tight or how do you get so many things done? It's cause I plan for it. You know, like I already packed my bag. Like that's why my backpack's super full today. But I packed my bag last night. I knew that um, I was gonna go train at Barbell in the morning, then drive all the way to Pasadena to kickbox. And then I knew I was gonna take a shower and then also bring extra clothes because we have a mini photo shoot for the Lotus stuff for our new, uh, not pumpkin spice, but we got like our own version of like a pumpkin latte matcha tacha matcha. I don't wanna give the wrong name out because we have an official name that they worked really hard on creating, but that. And so, so I have to bring all different sets of clothes. I brought my hygiene kit that you guys see from when I travel. So I bring my own soap, my own shampoo, my own gel, my own cologne, everything. So for me, I'm a big preparation person so that I can stay on track and move forward. And I, I view myself like, like as this little ninja. Bam, 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 bam. So I prep everything the night before so I'm never in a rush in the morning. And I'm ready to go. As soon as stupid ass David finishes taking a shower, we're gonna go to our meeting and I'll see you guys there. Oh my God. God. Damn, you guys trying to fuck me up, dude. Damn, Shit. Which one should I get into? Dude, you trying to have a meeting? And then, wait, I have a beer? Do you have any illegal things on the laptop? No. Oh, shit, I was trying to grow with facial hair at one point. I look ridiculous, man. Also, this is where we made the um, dick donuts at this place. Damn, full circle, that's crazy. And your roommates with her? Yeah. So what a small world. Are you taking it back now? I'm gonna just give some to my husband because you know he'll be sad. Yeah, <laughs> true. Yeah, we'll do 50-50. Yeah, you guys can share it and it'll be awesome. Okay. What? What does that say? It says something. Lotus times JK Bone. Oh, that's so tight. Damn. I want this. This one has a cone So cool. This one. Yeah, at the Lotus Me now. About to brainstorm some shit. Yo, what's up, Kelly? Hi. Maybe we should cut Good. It. And uh, but I, they always bring snacks, and I'm trying to be all fit, 
But damn, I think I'm gonna be good. I'm gonna be a good boy. I'm not gonna even touch one. Whoa. I'm so proud of myself. I'm not even gonna touch one. Just got home, and this guy immediately hands me this and tells me to come play with him. Shoot it! Shoot it, Taika! Almost! Which I think is super cuny, but what's really cuny is our city is about to have a uh, Christmas tree. <laughs> it's about to have a Christmas tree. Um, whoa, 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 shoot again, shoot again! Shoot again, ready, catch! No, don't catch it. Okay. okay. Shoot it. Go, 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 go. Go. Shoot it, Taika. Wow, good job. Whoa. I'll go talk over here because this guy's screaming. But um, our city is about to have like this Christmas tree lighting ceremony. And I think it'll be so beautiful. So we're going to take little Taika Malaika over there in uh, about an hour. And I can't wait to share that with you guys because since moving here um, I've been trying to get more involved with the city and like because this is the place we want to settle down at you know so um, I want to see all that too and I think this guy will love it especially since we love the holidays what are you doing in that corner looking for spiders you freaking weirdo I always wonder what Fawn thinks of them she must be like this guy's crazy <laughs> You're crazy! You're crazy, dude! Wow, this is super cool. It's a big event. Look, there's a bunch of people here. There's a stage. I don't even know what's going on. Look what they did to all the trees. They put lighting on all the trees. And then just, just like Halloween, they have all of their businesses out on the sidewalk and they cleared up the whole street again. This is so cool. Oh, hello, doggy. That's cool. Look at this. I love how they shut down this street for this event so that people could just walk around and go in the middle of the street. I don't know where the big Christmas tree is supposed to be. They are supposed to be lighting a Christmas tree, but oh, I think it's a play over there. This is pretty cool. Do you know where the Christmas tree is, mister? Where is it? Over there. Over there? Okay, we're gonna try to find it. See if we can find it. Wow, look at that, it's a big horsey. Cool, huh? Look, it's a big horsey. Wow, two big horsies. That's cool, huh? That's cool. What is that? What is that? Horsies. Horsies, yeah, look, there's more horsies. They're so smart. I'm so glad we taught these guys animals. Because then when he sees them, he knows what they are. What is that? Yeah, horsey. Yeah, horsey. You're smart. You're a smart guy. Okay, let's go find the Christmas tree. So I found the tree. And it's cool that it's not lit yet. Which means they're still going to light it. And you can see that everyone is... Yes, mister? Yeah? Yeah, Spider-Man. Yeah. You've got a good eye. So everyone is here waiting. I don't know when they're gonna light it, but I assume it should be pretty soon if everyone's standing out here waiting. I also don't want to be out here too long because I do want to get dinner with Mom Bear. So I'm not too sure how long I'm gonna stay out here for. So maybe we'll just hang for a little bit and if we can get the Christmas tree lit and show a little Taika Christmas, that'd be so cool. Oh, here's the whole tree. Look at that. That's nice, huh? It's big. Look at that. It's a big old tree, dude. Cool tree, huh? Out of all the things to look at here, Taika's having the most fun playing with the shadow. <laughs> Watch. We're just trying to walk, and this guy keeps looking at his shadow and dancing with him. So careful, careful. You can't get in people's way. Shadow's disappearing. Are you pooping? Uh-oh, we might have to change your diaper soon. Are you pooping? Come on, let's go. Taika. Okay. How come I feel like he just pooped on camera right now? And he, I need to put him on my shoulders to watch the Christmas tree lighting. I really hope he didn't poop. Please tell me he didn't poop. Uh, did 
you see it? Look how beautiful it is. Look how beautiful the tree is. Look at the Christmas tree. It's beautiful, huh? Let's take a picture for Mama, okay? No, go home. Get a burger. You want a burger? No? You want a burger? Okay. At the world famous in and now to get some food. I'm freaking starving. I'm actually proud of myself because when I was standing there waiting for the Christmas tree to go on, I was like, oh, can I just, maybe I should just post me some food or something. And then there's five guys close to me and their burgers are pretty bomb, but it's not as healthy as the way I order it from in and out Because when I get in and out I can get it. Uh, I do no cheese, double meat, no spread with ketchup and mustard, and that's way more low calories. So that's how I get my burger fix while still um, sticking to my diet. And I'm really proud of myself that I didn't do that. I was this close to ordering it. Ready for some burger? Yeah. <laughs> I think that guy's kind of tired. But yeah, gonna get some food and head home. Do you want to go sleep that bad monkey dude? No. Well, you keep turning off the light. It is time to go no. sleep. Gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's crazy. <laughs> this guy's crazy. You just scared? I just see like, cause the doors open up. I just see like him in different positions. Watch. Can you zoom in there? Yeah. Watch. <laughs> Do you see him? Yeah. <gasps> oh. Can candy? You want some candy? Ooh. Yeah. Candy. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. <laughs> He's you too win. smart. He's too smart. You He's too smart. He's like, you want imaginary like, candy? Okay, I got imaginary like... candy too. Candy. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> <laughs> As you can see, we're trying to put this little monkey to bed. But before he goes to bed, there's always a bunch of chaos thank you guys for uh watching our day and seeing how how my day can range anywhere from barbell to lotus to working out to get my ass beat to being back home and once again uh don't forget to go to barbellbrigade.com sign up for the newsletter to get first access and also a, a additional discount code off your entire black friday order all right, see you guys next time. Peace.